There she is, 14205. So today we're headed up to, ooh, let me get the sun out of my face, there we go. Today we're headed up to Long Island, but first we're gonna stop in Philadelphia, so that's what this flight is gonna be. Um, I've never flown into Philly International. Um, weather's pretty decent, there's a few thunderstorms around, so I filed IFR. Um, we'll get rolling and hopefully get up there quickly. Let's hop into plane. Clear prop! Ground, Skylane 14205. Um, we'd like to pick up our IFR. Skylane 14205, lease for ground, IFR, current time request. Skylane 14205, clearance. Uh, 205, ready to copy. Skylane 205, clear to Philadelphia Airport, cap. Uh, after departure, uh, turn right, head in 300. Expect radar vectors to Woolley, Victor 214, DuPont, direct. Maintain 3000. Expect 7000, one after departure. Departure 125.05, squawk 5670. Okay, uh, Skyline 14205 is cleared to the Philadelphia airport. Uh, after departure, uh, right turn to 300, then Woolley. Uh, Victor 214, DuPont direct, uh, climb to 3,000, expect 7,000, 10 minutes after departure, 12505 is my departure frequency, 5670 for my squawk. For Columbia, what's this? Skyline 205, you read uh, that, is correct. 205 is ready to taxi. Skyline 205, clear to land. Taxi to 17, rear parallel, parallel to 205. Ground 05780, Papa with the weather, a taxi to 17 to get my IFR command, please. The stewards at 5780, Papa. Please for tower, Skyline 14205, ready to go, ready, uh, runway 17. Skyline 14205, please for tower, hold short, runway 17, no waiting release. Holding short 17, uh, 14205. Skyline 14205, runway 17, wind 180 at 6, clear for takeoff. Clear for takeoff 17, 14205. Skyvetch is 214, save position. Skyvetch is 214, is at 5 to the west. 5 to the west, roger. Traffic departing runway 17 with a right turn to the northwest uh, sky lane. Looking, okay, Skyvetch is 214. Alright, your speed's alive. Get moving. See? And then and we're off. Wraps up. Tower series 578 to pop with a run up ready for release. Series 578 Sierra Papa, Leesburg Tower, hold short runway 17, awaiting release. Hold short 17, HPAPA. Skyline 205, traffic 5 miles to the west, inbound from midfield right down in Skyhawk, contact departure, see ya. Uh, looking for traffic and over to departure, see ya. Potomac departure, Skyline 14205, just off Leesburg, 1000 for 3000. Four two zero five, your radar contact. One mile southwest of Leesburg Airport. Climb maintain seven thousand. Continue on your three hundred heading. Traffic up to, to seven thousand uh, three hundred uh, heading for two hundred five. All right, everybody, we're off. Uh, I filed IFR, as you guys know, because there's Here a couple. Guard. There's a couple storms between here and Philadelphia, but we should be able to pick our way through them pretty easily. Okay, uh, this should be a fun flight. I'll put the map up right now. So as you can tell, uh, took off from Leesburg and our planned uh, route goes Woolly and then uh, 
particularly over, over Baltimore and up to the Pond uh, VOR, and then direct it to Philly. But I think that we'll probably end up getting something a little more direct. Number 205, to see direct to Willie. Direct to Willie, 205. Order 720, direct to Aries. here but it's not that bad um, there's this little little layer out front here I bet I could squeeze through it VFR but it's not worth it at this point we're close enough uh, and I'll just just send down and go from there number two zero five descend to maintain four thousand turn right zero seven zero <laughs> Down to 4,000, right, 070, 205. Radar 205, let's make the A out to, let's just send to 3,000. Down to 3, 205, turn 20 degrees left sector for the sequence. We'll be following a uh, E145 in Embryo. 20 degrees left for 205, and I'll be looking for the Embryo. I'm in and out of clouds right now. 1 kilo alpha at the airport, 12 o'clock, about 7 miles. 1 kilo alpha, field to site. 1 kilo alpha, Cluvis approaching to Chester County, report cancellation of IFR as soon as practice. Go ahead and cancel IFR now, thank you, 1 kilo alpha. 1 kilo alpha, cancellation of the squad VFR from exchange approved. VFR, frequency change, good day. 205 has the traffic in sight. 205, turn right heading of 100, you said you have the uh, Embraer in sight? Yep, 205 has the Embraer in sight. 205, Roger, you can follow that traffic and close the approach for only one step. Approach number 5 on just 7.5, this is 6,000 with Zulu looking for the, uh, the visual to stick to McGuire. Number 205, you can follow the traffic, clear visual approach runway 17. Cleared visual approach runway 17 for 205, sorry, you got stepped on. Yep. 205, contact Julie Tower 118.5. 118.5 for 205, thanks, yeah. Record 5936, Philly traffic's going to hold down field, cross line 9 left at Echo, go to Echo 5, connect Grand Hawk. Uh, cross line left at Echo, Echo 5, to rapid 5936. Philly Tower, Skyline 14205 on a visual 17. Skyline for 17, continue. Skyline 205, uh, we'll call you number 2, runway 17, clear to land, traffic holds, departs right 9 left. Wind is 1105. Number 2 for runway 17, 14205. 4 to go. Runway is in 2603, we'll call you 3. Came out 47895. Blue streak 55816. Golf stream 102, Bravo Golf 7. Blue Shake, uh, let's see, South 1424 8 and Delta 2115 about 9. 
American 1623 heavy. Next guy is very slow in about 8 out for 17. Fly heading of 0809 left, clear for takeoff. 080, zero, clear for takeoff on 9 left, American 1623 heavy. Fairing 1008, your discretion. Very slow. Turbines for 9 left, line up weight traffic about uh, 7 out for only 1 7. 7 weight traffic only 9 left, Springs 1008. Golf stream 2 Bravo Golf, let's take you out early. Uh, you can make the right there on Whiskey, hold short right 9 left. I'll get you out in a couple. Short 9 left on Whiskey for 2 Bravo Golf. And American 845, just follow the Golf stream onto Whiskey and I'll make you about 4 or 5. Thank you, behind the Golf stream. Okay, we're, we're on short ish final. He just called me very slow, which is really funny. Um, I'm just trying to go as fast as I can on this one. Bearing 1008, uh, caution for the wake turbines. Traffic is slow and about 4 off for 17, heading to 080. Runway 9 left, you clear for takeoff. Runway 9 left, you clear for takeoff. Rings 1008. American 2603, fill your 827, make it 9 left. Line up away. Traffic is slow and about 4 off for 817. Line up away, 9 left, American 2603. Just at two, medevac, just at two, fully maintain VFR, the altimeter is 3013. What do you need? Uh, VFR, uh, request transition to center city landing, Jefferson Hospital. Okay, traffic's landing 17 today, so I can't get you through uh, 17. There's traffic descending from the north right now, so you'll have to uh, remain west of uh, runway 17 arrival right now. I can't help you out unless you go north. Roger, I'll just stay away, Class Bravo airspace, just that too, thank you. Yeah, the traffic is about uh, at your, make it 10 o'clock and about 4 miles at 20, currently 2,500, tracking inbound. Roger, just that too, switching back, we're staying away, uh, staying clear, Bravo, just that too. We gotta wait for this guy to land, traffic's gonna cross downfield, American 2603. Copy that. United 638, uh, Philly traffic's going to hold down field, cross the runway 9 left at uh, Echo at Echo 5, contact the ramp. Going to cross down left at Echo Echo 5, we'll go over to ramp, United 638. Fair wing 1008 to contact departure. Departs at 1008, good Tower helicopter 5, Mike Hotel. Helicopter 5, uh, Mike Hotel. Turning around, going westbound now, uh, I'll be a little further north of your airport this time. Okay, just stay clear, uh, well, I got one arrival, but if you're going to stay three north of the airport at 200 feet, that's not going to hurt anybody, so just maintain VFR, Altimeter 3013. If you're going to do something different than that, just let me know. Uh, my mic will tell Wilco, thank you, sir. Traffic will fly past over the top, you on a short file, two-mile file there. Five mic will tell. Philadelphia, Paymont, uh, 53. Minimums. Minimums. 50, 13. Philly, there's a helicopter head to the right, but he's eastbound. He'll pass just underneath you, continuing east around 1300. Your next right, 17, clear to land, wind 1403. Traffic holds, departs right 9 left. Right, 17, clear to land, Paymont, 53. Thanks. You know, I might see another helicopter once you get closer to the airport, but he's around 200 feet, so he's going to be north of the airport at least two miles, so he won't bother you either. Hey, Mark, 53, thanks for the traffic. That was the only one I had, so you can uh, cut the corner there if you want through the Bravo and maintain VFR. Exiting to the left, Gulf Delta Alpha over to Atlantic. See ya. Here we go, American 2603. Next guy is 5 out for 17. Fly heading of 080. Right 9 left, declare for takeoff. Heading 080, clear takeoff, 9 left, American 2603. One seven zero Mike Romeo, Philly Roger. Uh, we'll call you number two, right? One seven zero nine zero nine zero. Okay, so before we close this video out, um, I'm sure a bunch of you want to know how it was flying into Philly, um, and 
what it actually costs to fly into an airport like that. So first of all, let's talk about flying in. Um, as you saw, I landed on runway 17. They tend to put the GA aircraft on runway 17 when people are landing on 9 and 27, um, mostly because they just want to keep you out of the way of the big planes. That does create a problem, though, because you could get a pretty decent crosswind, which I had in landing. Um, not a big deal. As for cost, um, let's put the receipt up right here. Um, first cost is 20 bucks for the security fee. That's pretty standard at a big class Bravo airport. Then there's a $40 facility fee. They waive that though with if you buy 15 gallons of gas. So in reality, didn't get charged for that, even though the gas was a little bit expensive at $6.95 a gallon. Um, and then the landing fee is 12 bucks. Again, super cheap. And compared to landing at Boston, which I'll put the video right up here, um, it's actually inexpensive. Um, I think in Boston, I ended up paying an extra 250 or $300 worth of just ancillary fees. Um, the entire experience is pretty awesome. Uh, I'll put the Boston video here, subscribe right up here, and the next video will actually be me taking off VFR from Philadelphia. So come along for that one. Uh, thanks for coming along. I'm sorry for not having posted in the last few months for flying. I'm just way, way too busy with this stuff. Anyway, uh, see you later.